Hey guys, good morning. Vampire Elch pouring in. Been up late, I don't even know how late. But, uh, we're still starting, uh, decent times, 5 pm. We have a uh, Empire campaign here, Reichland. We started yesterday, played for about uh, 7 hours, 39 turns. Uh, this uh, previous campaign is all finished. Short campaign victory, short campaign victory, short campaign victory. And uh, this we played until uh, 156, which was when the Chaos Invasion arrived. So it was not even possible to win this campaign before turn 150 without a uh, uh, crazy expansion. We have a Reichland campaign, one of the milestone campaigns. Uh, this one we are not allowed to use artillery units in uh, armies, in the armies, which means uh, no mortars, no great cannons, no hell blaster volley guns, no hellstone rocket batteries, no war wagon mortars, no steam tanks, no white, uh, black lions, and uh, no luminar cohesh. Thank you. Give me a double coffee here. Today is Thursday. Since I uh, since I went on a diet, changed my uh, eating habits. Thursday has become a kebab day. It's uh, been my third kebab this month. Pretty much uh, breakfast and lunch for today. So I guess we're not even gonna have a food break, but we might have a nap break later. Who knows? Uh, King Roman says, "What the hell?" Are you gonna be no lifing uh, cyberpunk? Gonna you know just transfer your uh, your consciousness in dead world for a uh, for a week or two? Hey, Scotty. Hey, Sega. Okay. So what's going on here? Uh, with the usual, we're taking uh, Reichland turn five uh, with the uh, helm shot. So turn six, we start to stabilize. Fighting Skull Smashers, they were not uh, raised here early, so we were fighting them off. We actually made peace with them, and the Beastmen somehow survived. There are a couple of uh, sieges at Helmshard, and they did invite another Beastmen uh, uh, tribe to attack us, and they did raise Dotenbach, and uh, it got occupied by Hochland. So far, we've been in uh, war with uh, Wisseland, uh, the fealty, uh, uh, low fealty event. Uh, the Vampires are doing really good. Uh, they destroyed uh, three electro counts, uh, Stillland, Ourland, and Soland. So we're losing six authority there. I have a chance to lose uh, field every turn now. A little less stocks. Uh, this is a uh, as much as can be planned here regarding the system. Uh, when the vampires are trying to stabilize you, you lose authority. And it actually works fine uh, when there's actually an opposition in the Empire. Otherwise, you know, uh, the last time when the Empires were just, you know, in a, in a vegetable mode. Vegetable counts. Uh, the authority system was uh, basically just uh, passive. You know, when can I, you know, get authority? When can I get confederated? And nothing really uh, uh, was challenging you. The vampires are supposed to be challenging you in this system. Thank you, Ron. Uh, so we have uh, Reichland fortified. Uh, this is our main army here. Uh, we had to get halberdiers because we seen Manfred with like nine units of Black Knights, Black Knights bully swordsmen. So we had to get halberdiers. Uh, we have uh, Emperor's Finest. Oh, this opening just makes the early game Empire so so much better and more enjoyable. Karl Franz also gives uh, twelve leadership to the early units as well. Uh, Halberdiers as well, so and then all units, so it's like perfect to fight the vampires. You get also early sort of seal, you can easily duel them. Uh, this is the uh, uh, Karl Franz build. We gave uh, fighter bell skills and lightning strike. It's just ideal for him. You only need two points here to get this. This is not worth it. This is, uh, uh, you know, yes or no, depending if you really want it. But uh, uh, honestly, until they make it faction wide, uh, it's uh, just a filler point if you have extra. I'd rather put, uh, honestly, Mr. Resistance. Uh, situation here uh, we're at war with. Uh, this guy is still there. It was a close battle there. Uh, we're at war with two Beastman factions. Uh, we have gotten all of the uh, diplomatic corps top. Uh, side uh, before turn 40. I think it was by turn 35. 
the seven key technologies uh, diplomacy with Bretonia, divorce, high elves, and uh, the dons of men. So, uh, basically, got the order tide assembled. Uh, we just need to get Purge of the Fell, so we get 10 melee attack and 10 leadership when fighting against uh, the, uh, the Vampire Counts in this case. Very strong technology. Uh, the other ones are not really a top priority. Uh, we do have to deal with this one here. Yeah, uh, hopefully this is the only thing they have. They did cost us uh, a region here. Uh, Dotenbach, we lost iron. And this guy's taken a marble earlier, so uh, we have to look into confederating Hochland sooner than later. Because this is a resource which we need, we need for the economy for the second army. Nomshard is on tier 3, pretty good garrison. Uh, got some experience, fought off uh, several uh, waves there. All successful. Uh, we're not worried along anymore with the skull smashers. Working our diplomacy to uh, get the overtide uh, friendly, and uh, we'll be fighting the vampires today. That the lady grants you safe passage in these. I accept. Another trade agreement. Yes. Come I think at 90 they should Sigma's give us trade agreement. There is no reason whatsoever no. that they don't give us a 90. I, 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 this one, uh, they really need to. Uh, Check into into the treaties with the with the empire as Reichland, because the trade agreement should be always a yes with 50 relations, because they are the empire. It's not like they're a competing faction. If they if they if they are uh, friendly, which meaning the uh, the field is high, which means they should always say yes to trade. So this is a little bit wonky with uh, uh, with the basic treaties with the rest of the empire. They should definitely take a look in, in, into it. But 90, uh, there is no reason for them to decline. If they decline, this is uh, uh, definitely have to be fixed. On it. Okay. So takes 90 for the trade agreement, which is a little bit bizarre. They should they should accept the agreements already at 50. So diplomacy with the rest of the empire is definitely a bit wonky. It needs to be uh, checked checked out for sure. There is no reason for these guys. They do not compete with us unless they have low of fealty. And then then you have event to deal with them. The Empire is here uh, basically to serve as, uh, uh, you know, you for manage with prestige and authority and buffers. They're not competing with you. They are, you are pretty much the same faction. There's no reason for these guys to be friendly and not accept treaties. One only thing what? that is bad Welcome enough, you cannot invite them to war. You cannot invite them to war, which uh, I feel like uh, they removed because... Uh, the AI would have probably been inviting uh, other uh, Empire factions to war against you. So I guess it's a double-edged sword. It's probably be better that this doesn't exist. But then again, uh, they could have went to a little bit, uh, you know, extra. They could have uh, used electoral machinations to invite, uh, like say, Middleland. You pay 800, and they will invite on a, on a war. Depending how strong the enemy faction is, it will uh, cause that much prestige to one to a war. But you know, this is all rocket science. You know, too complicated to create. So they put uh, something useless as the crystallations, which makes no sense to have even have any options for the empire. You are managing other empire factions. Uh, the only uh, reason to for the crystallations to exist is to push fealty into negative. For them to, uh, you know, to force, uh, you know, a war between you and another faction, like Wiesland early, if it proxying too much positive authority, so you would use the uh, the prestige to lower relations between you and Wiesland, so uh, uh, the chances for them to try to, uh, you know, uh, separate, uh, you know, declare independence is higher, and you know, go to war faster. But uh, this, uh, this, this is a pretty good chance of happening even without that. So like. So, this is the only reason for the crystallization to exist. If field is very low, so you even further, lo uh, lower it even further, and you basically uh, kind of uh, use prestige to start a war between you and another Empire faction instead of waiting for confederation. Uh, increasing fealty is easy enough that the crystallization should not exist. This should be an option to improve relations, and they should rename this option here. Uh, invite uh, a faction to war. So you click on Tal Beckland it is good to see and uh, uh, have day. option to, uh, let, let's say, Bismar 106. This is a pretty weak faction. It should probably cost you under 1000 prestige for them to uh, guarantee join the war against the Bismar. This uh, option does not make no sense to exist, so it should just be to invite the war.
So remove the chrysalations, put invite to war, and depending how strong is a faction you want to uh, invite to war against, uh, should cost uh, uh, different amounts of prestige. Uh, where are we? We can go fight uh, uh, these guys here. Let's actually see here. Uh, we have this at eight. Uh, the five percent proc three times. Nice. Who uh, calls? Three here as well. So. Uh, haven't proc a single time in Osland. Uh, once with Hochland, but we sided with them in political events. Yes. And uh, we can get more authority here. It should probably trigger next turn. Uh, yes. Right now, uh, the plan is to fight the, emp the vampires. Uh, and then uh, go to go to war with uh, Hochland. I mean, uh, fight the vampires and go to uh, AF Confederate with Hochland. Uh, don't reach it at the same time as you're uh, saying your plans. Well, I'm really, really that makes no sense to me for this system they created. Because uh, you can only uh, decrease relations between uh, the Empire factions. Is a limited use for sure. They're removing invitation to war to prevent the, the other emperor inviting other emperor against you. Should have uh, created an option for using prestige to invite the other factions of emperor factions to war against other factions. So, honestly, uh, Salakiel, uh, the replenishment should be uh, possible inside, uh, in case of the empire with a uh, uh, with a military axis. So that's another oversight Salakil as well, which all they were talked about. If you have a military access with uh, one of these factions, uh, replenishment should be happening instead of alliance. All right. So uh, military access should allow replenishment uh, in the empire for the empire. Uh, we went to war with Wisland together with Hochland. So uh, it was a uh, uh, we sided with Hochland. It then went to war with Wisland. And the Hochland uh, was fighting Wisland. Uh, Hochland managed to get this one, and uh, Beastman got raised this one, so we lost it uh, to occupation. They just immediately clicked it. We didn't have a chance to uh, take it back. Summon the Elector Counts. We should destroy this Beastman and uh, uh, start fighting the vampires. Now, vampires are uh, somewhat busy, and we make, may need to make them even busier. Sig by Sigmar's will. Yes. Yes. Approach as friend. I will not obey. The uh, approach as friend. Disagree with that. We did get technology for plus 25 in one public order. So yeah, this is going to be a high chance not to succeed. But uh, it has to build up. It's not instantaneous. Absolutely not. This is going to 53. This should be enough for trade. Whoa. Welcome, men of the Empire. I agree. If you're looking for guidance how to play an Empire campaign, uh, this technology pretty much tells you everything. These are your friends, your uh, three partners, your potential allies, and these are your enemies. Lord, you address the Asur of Althuan. Gladly. Why did faction did not disappear? There's also a bug going on with. Uh, it's actually not a bug, so, it's just sheer design. I'm ready to when uh, one of these defenses happen against Norsk or the Skaven or whatever, a random lord gets picked from the pool, and he can actually pick uh, uh, one of your uh, lords that are there. Because uh, you're not using my dime and then disappear forever. As you can see, this one uh, uh, got picked out automatically and she just, he got just killed. Even if he survives, he never comes back, he's just dead, gone, forever. So, I this is quite a little bit more here. polishing, for sure. Who calls? 
Bring me to my men. Oh, nice! They didn't retreat. We might actually get a good follow-up as well. This is actually a good battle uh, for the uh, for the war wagons. I'll give fear and terror to Rise Guard. Uh, they buff the uh, War Wagon's damage. They're no longer using Outrider damage, but stronger damage. The technology still suck. My subjects call. Like really bad. Sigma calls. War Machines. Uh, this is not even. This is considered Missile Chariot. Should be buffed by the Missile buffs, not even the War Machine buffs. General. I still find the uh, the war wagons much better than pistoliers. What do you think? After all, pistoliers are lower tier. So uh, there was Sire there. Huh? Great sword. Probably gonna be shooting the great sword. The Empire ensures. Great swords. Got that nice 30, uh, 24 melee attack uh, for the great swords. War Priest goes amazing with the uh, with the great swords. Pretty much goes amazing with any uh, Empire units. Is one of the most important uh, characters in the army. Shield of faith. For Heldenhammer! Halberdiers! The enemy does have a lot of range, but uh, we can count the range in our range. We are Sigma's heirs! Weapons ready! Halberdiers! Halberdiers are currently at uh, nice defense. They get even better. Halberdiers almost seems that it actually has end game battle skill. The All the swordsmen, spearmen, uh, 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 weapon battle skills kind of sucks. They just have no damage. Less toughness as well. Show us the vote. Swordsmen and uh, spearmen like this in units in the like for the first four turns. I will not stand. You still use them a little bit further, but uh, you should be switching to other ones. Call France. You almost have a dead claw. Right this battle France. should give us dead claw. Heart battlefield now. Ready! Take the ground! The only technology Move buff the war wagons have is uh eight percent missile resistance. It's a huge oversight. All the uh all the technologies for the war machine should be buffing the war wagons. They're also missing a speed buff as well, which should be a thing too. Yes, general! Maybe one day the next time party work. I can answer, they're gonna be doing a little bit more damage. Quick march! Formation march! Moving now! Ready! Take the ground! Rex Guard Knights! For the I think this buffer of War Wagons uh, makes them uh, pretty good uh, once you get a veteran battle skill. But still, uh, uh. It's usable, but they're better units to use. 
Why would you micro a uh, Warwagon yes, when you can micro Steam Tank? Yes, General. Yenbar has powerful march. economy. To battle. To battle. If you have a rank 7 Warwagon, you're probably gonna get a Steam Tank at that point. For old dog. Obey. Moving now. We obey. Yes, General. Sir, no lingering. Rights guard knights. Rights guard. Yes, sir. Ready to serve at speed. Sit back, calls. Yes, sir. That's why the uh, missing of the technology is even more upsetting. Because uh, uh, there's no point using this unit of the, of the, uh, against the steam tank. Taking position! It's our infantry! No one warning the scouts. Powder dry! We obey! Moving now! Sigma calls! Quick march! Get them! Ready for war! Halberdiers, sir! Take aim! Shoot them! Attack! To battle! For the Empire! Curses. Rexburg Knights! Rah! For the Emperor! My subjects call! Oh, she did damage by the yes, side of what quickly. the fuck? Missile troops! Take aim! Charge! We are Sigma heads. Great swords. Yes. My interest since they got the anti-large bonus, uh, uh, anti-humanity bonus makes them so them fucking deadly against anything. Anything is on foot. Withdraw! Missiles at the ready. For held on hammer. Very well. To combat. Courts. Great swords! Moving now! By Ulrich's wrath! Take the ground! I enter did uh, quite a bit of damage there yes, before they, these guys started getting killed. Great Those swords. Minotaurs, by the way, fight to death. Oh, wait, every oh, single one of them is Take dead. The it makes them even worse damage. Might as well be unbreakable. We serve the Emperor for the Helden Hammer! Right Skirt Knights! That uh, uh, downhill kind of sucked for us. This mine is it way more damage than expected. The uh, dual wheel mine thrusts are super deadly against him. One of the deadliest scenes in the game in Melon. Shit overcast. Guessing that bar they actually jumped twice. Some of the clip that shit. What's that supposed to be? Yes, General. For the Emperor. See the ammunition. No lingering. We fought him uh, uh we fought him uphill and definitely shows. Definitely shows. Yes, General. Go take the ground. Sigma guides us. Go, sir. Take it position. Dance for seeing. Moving now. Why is it, what the fuck is going on with this guy? Yo! What the hell, man? Drunk driver! Drunk driver! Yes, 
Battle quickly. This is a new bug. I have not seen that before. Red Scar. Wizard ready. Fire at will for the Emperor. Target and fire. Sir, quick march on foot. Let's see that clip. Holy shit, at overcast. Yes. Look at the hell bar. Oh. What is the damage? It's bugged. We've Holy taken double shit, or overcast. double miscast. Yes. Holy shit, at overcast. It's, it's maybe miscast or Zygor? twice. Maybe we taken miscast damage from the Cyber effect and our effect. I thought this was just the uh, penalty to your miscast. That's the only thing that would explain this shit. This thing has uh, plus 25% miscus chance, but it causes a separate miscus damage. That seems bugged. Because this increases your miscus chance. Put it to 43. But we're taking double damage there. Some of the clip that actually jumped twice. Yes, in that shit at overcast. Holy shit at overcast. Yeah, that's double miscast Holy damage. Shit at Saigur might be doing a separate miscast damage as well, so he actually getting miscast damage twice. This is a bug, this should not work like this. The Saigur increases the, the chance of you taking miscast damage from your own spells, does not uh, cause you to take additional damage from another miscast. With, uh, with the ability the Soul Eater. So it increases the Miska's chance, but it causes another Miska's damage on top of Miska's damage. Ready, go. It's a multiplayer thing. I don't know how uh, this uh, hasn't been reported or fixed. Maybe it's a, maybe it's a new thing. It's actually a pretty good thing for the multiplayer. So increases the miscast chance, but we're taking double miscast damage. See, we're taking it only once now. So that one was definitely bugged. He dealt 1400 damage to himself with miscasts. Because he has uh, no armor, no resistances. Uh, it's, I guess it's possible, Akatama. But it should not work like that. That the, one of the mines was so deadly there. Uh, Marcona says, Elich, I blame you. I played a dwarf campaign until almost 4 a.m. last night. It has to be your fault. Not mine for not having any self control. Oh, by the way. Yoo hoo! No self control, this guy. I command here. Moving off. Tremble, mortal. Does Franz not? We have to go to war with them, but we also have to replenish. The Empire. Yoo Dead claw. Flying monster. Hell yeah. Uh, 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 change the potions again. Bring me to my men. You have to trespass and defeat the beastman here now. Come then, only Sigma's god. Uh, we can't resolve here. Those greats are dead. Troop! 
troops ready! Reichsguard knights! The Empire endures! My baby! To me, man! We're Sigmar's heirs! The Empire and yours! Halberdiers! For the Emperor! Go! My rule is absolute! Moving now! Grace on! Shoot that beast, man. Ulrich's wrath on them! We are Sigmar's heirs! Yes, General! I command in your stead! For the Helden Hammer! For Helden Hammer! At least the patch, but there's any patch notes. No lingering. Says that is an update. Sigma calls. Uh -huh. Quick match. No lingering. Sir. Taking that position. To battle! Get sir, quickly! Take the ground! In range! Powder dry! Ready! Ready! Sigma the Emperor! Blood. To battle! More ring survival now, they have more damage. It doesn't hurt to have one or two in the army. Seems like they're doing okay damage. I still feel like uh, they're not gonna be any good until rank 7. They don't get any buffs from uh, missile technologies or the missile battle skill. They do get the artillery buff on the uh, battle skills, which we are not getting this campaign. So, with that, artillery master uh, uh, could actually be pretty good. No nice flavor unit.
they did they got a uh, nice damage buff. They kind of like better pistoliers because uh, they can do melee against infantry. I am Prince and Emperor. Replenishing got war with vampires. Bring me to my men. Sigma compels us onward. Okay, we're gonna get a rebellion here, which is beautiful. See, hey, shit, wizard. Uh, summons the great eagle, powerful unit, ideal for combat. This one and the other one. I command here. We can get silver bullets. Of judgment ready. We are uh, gonna Come be starting a war with the vampires. They do have a lot. More sleep side. As long as their army are not of this uh, grade, all of them uh, we should do fine. Generating 30 from the settlements. Uh, continue with the volley fire. What? Well, should uh, hit uh, about eight seconds now. Huh? We also Ready. have to consider getting the bells, uh, the veteran bell skill as well, the sharpshooter, which is very good. But right, we'll get lightning strike first. Diplomacy is looking all right around. What brings you before the air of Lund? The beastmen are still active, so they might attack uh, Helm Shard. Might even have better units this time. They just need pretty much uh, 19 gores, and this city is could be fucked. Nineteen gore hurts uh, could be enough to take it. Hey, cooks. I feel like they're gonna be spamming something. As, uh, as long as a mix of uh, infantry and large, we should be fine. Just uh, infantry, it's a little bit problematic. We don't have enough uh, uh, to defend the wall properly. We'll be attacking Fafeldor if it's gonna be initial attack. Uh, we have siege attacker now. Mm, 
we have a low prestige, so uh, we are going to just uh, do the state gift. Uh, it's a unique uh, building. I think it's something here uh, because uh, Vermintide uh, reference. You get a Tain, Emperor, Captain, Waste Stoker, Witch Hunt, and a Bright Wizard. Go with this fine. rebellion and then probably gonna go fight, fight uh, attack this Show place. Don't fret, they'll be open. Hmm. Who calls? Attack. Definitely want another battle here. I don't want this unit to take damage. I need this unit. Uh, the tier 3 settlement breast gives uh, additional Emperor Captain. Are you saying not giving us Witch Hunter? What do you bid? The Empire endures! We are ready! Yes, General! Yes, General! For the Emperor! For the Empire! Ready! Why are you taking so much damage there? Don't really, uh, uh, I guess we need more defense. Must have been just directly hit a couple of times. 
such a nice fear effect in Call France. It can get even better. It's a terror effect, pretty amazing one. By Ulrich's rough. Can charge the units damage or no? You can just knock them down. The metal damage does not turn far. I command here. Men, I will fight with you. What in the shit? What's up with this thing here? What's with the health bar and three moles? Seems bugged. Pick up the pace. Franz, they will obey. I am Prince and Emperor. Let's finish the punishment here. We have capped uh, uh, here. Ah, uh, not capped. Uh, this is almost how much we need. Uh, two more levels in the lightning strike. Shield of Fate, beautiful. Get me last points counting. How's the pain now? Pretty good. Is it time? Uh, this state of vampires reminds me of Warhammer 1. The worst thing so is we have to trespass through Hochland to get to these guys. We need one more fealty here. They have negative authority. That's the they worst thing. We can get silver bullets uh, as the last unit. We can even get the white wolves. Press very low time. 29 ammo. Yeah, looking good. Lightning strike uh, uh, will be ideal because the vampires are actually quite large. They outnumber us like three times right now. Look. Welcome to Fair Britain. Turn 42, we can ask for financial aid. Huh? Roof for tribe uh, tributes. Oh, don't tell me Karak Zilfon will do this. Oh, wow, they might do it. Way to go, Karak Zilfon. Get that corruption out of my sight. The nation calls. This is fine, actually. I'm going to search you on the witch hunter. He's a rogue agent. I trust no man. Is it time? When they get more authority. I don't know why uh, the ask is here. I think it might have actually. So Sylvania, 
least we have so many enemies and they're still alive somehow. Sylvania, Sylvania. 13 regions, rank 5. And there are toward border princes, Ostland, Karak uh, here and Karakadrin. That's actually pretty good for us. I won't be able to fight all sides. Then something has gotta give. Let's start with Solent. Friends of the Empire, come. We need a confederate uh, uh, Hochland, but we don't have authority right now. We won't have positive authority. So we need to increase authority before we consider confederation. Wow! Way to go, Karak Ziflin. Way to go. So low. Uh, this is low fealty. Uh, okay. Hail to your emperor, manlings. Be gone. No give. The F. Welcome, my countrymen. Not likely. What is the fealty with uh, with this faction? Four. It can happen as low as four. I don't think it can happen in lower than four. Um. Hail, fellow nation of men. I will not. So, you have a proposal? Looks like uh, they're getting attacked aid. by the vampires, which is good. Which means not all uh, uh, vampire armies are at home. Summon the Elector Counts! It is night. Tools of judgment ready. Step to it! And it's good we have this Witch Hunter so we know uh, what the rest of their arms are. Walter. Pick up the pace! But, and what can the Dowie do for you on this fine day? This guy's desperate need of friends, huh? I agree. I. What brings you before the air of. Impossible! Yep. Yeah. Welcome, men of the. Order's heated. Get the economy maxed here. Okay, we'll uh, uh, attack Feldorf. It's gonna be a surprise declaration of war. We have the initiative here. We have the, the siege attack now. No artillery will make the sieges uh, quite different with the Empire. They do dominate sieges with artillery. I hold Galmaraz. You may. I feel like they asked this because of trespassing, the word we might have talked. So this does sometimes happen in our favor. Seek out the heretics. So this small guy has range in Faldorf and there is Mumford here as well. He did got diminished a bit. Let's see if we can block this arm. Would be ideal. Report! Fail on 46. Well, what can you do? Now let's see uh, who needs help here. Who called? Approach as friend and make. 42. All right. What? Skull Smash is yes. still at war. They're warring. They're actually warring World Walkers. This is great. Honor. Welcome, friends. What do the men of the hammer? Never. Agreed. Okay, another trade agreement. Um, welcome, friends. I what? will. What? Step forth, true friend. One. Welcome, men of the Empire. Nine. The Vince Alliance does give us military axes, though. To honor to your ancestors. No. no we don't want defensive the lines there. Our princes are looking okay. Yes? For some reason they're not at war with orcs. Who are uh, seem to be doing uh, not so great. They lost the capital.
Bring me to my. Does Franz not dare to come before? So we can have border so, princes here. They might give us diplomacy for joining the war. I hope your words are wise. And we avoid the one Karstens for a few turns at least. No. No, sir. Not enough trade. Affirmative. By joining the war here, we got some uh, leverage in diplomacy. So we got non aggression war princes, which will lead to a trade agreement. They also now at war with their enemies, which will uh, make it even easier. And by joining a war with Sylvania, Ready. we bypass their alliance with Von Karstens. As we join the uh, Border Princess War against uh, Sylvania and not declare war on the uh, Vampire Alliance. I command here. And uh, we'll attack Feldorf here. I'm also a little bit surprised these two are not recruiting right now. Must be just raising dead. I am Prince and Emperor. Army on the left, army on the right, 50-50. The main advantage we can get against the vampire is getting a lot of life, but uh, we don't have it available right now. We're gonna have to be a little bit careful in the sieges, uh, not go too crazy until we get uh, uh, some healing and more experience. Legend of Lord Scanner died, they just uh, can get destroyed, their factions can get destroyed. Yes! We do have 29 ammunition to crossbows with uh, uh, 20 base missile damage and 71 PC missile damage. We do have also now the Shield of Fate, very good for melee, together with Hammer of Sigmar. The, uh, this one is just incredible he uh, hero for support and does give armor replenishment. Sigma calls. We need to get closer to the city. Halberdiers! For Heldenhammer! Halberdiers! For Heldenhammer! Are, uh, we not in line of fire. We are Sigma's heirs. Crossbows ready, General. Shield of faith. For Helden Hammer. And uh, we can go uh, fight here. Prepare for combat. Crossbows 
ready, General! We serve the Emperor! For Heldenhammer! The Empire endures! Crossbows ready, General! Ready for war! Send some uh, great suits on the wall. The They're meant to fight on the wall. The it's better we have regrow though. I will not stand this is not siege towers with this vigor. Well, uh, we are really going to need a lot of life uh, without the artillery. It's like it's. Especially if you're gonna fight out number. This is really weak to crossbows. This is the minimal angle we need to shoot over the wall. This is actually a nasty unit when it gets supported. It's stronger than the great swords. But they're really weak to range. Vegan have been causing a lot of friend of fire. The command is mine. Not any damage. We have to deal with Grave Guard here. Not ideal. Uh, let's wait for the Great Swords to climb the wall. Grave Guard murder Halberdiers in a uh, in, uh, fight. How do they have 96 armor? I had to fit a guild now. By Ulrich's wrath! We obey. By Galmaraz! Sigma! Gain our fire! Warrior priest! Ready for war! Creators! It's an uh, coward inside now, so they don't have any large here. They don't send any in the flies, so will be minimal cash to battle here. Ready 
send everything we got here. Done enough. Take a breather. To battle! We are Sigma's heirs! Great swords! Curse the foe! Great swords! Sir, shoot them! State troops! Ready! Whoa! No lingering! Yours! Take position! Crossbowman! Form a ring of steel! Call Sans! Attack! By Gal Marez! Save ammunition! Standing by! How are these guys still here? Great swords! God damn, I love the warrior priest. Quick march! Wizard of death. Take position! Go! How many is? 
How it is! Form a ring of steel! Help it is! Taking position! No lingering! We are Sigma's heirs! Ready? Yes, sir. Yes, my lord! Formation, march! Crossbowmen! To me, men! For Helden What are you guys reading? Is there any been the uh, page notes? Just guess you're just guessing, huh? Call France for the comet ready. Crossbows ready, General! Understood! Oh my god! Have you seen that shit? Holy shit! Shut the battle him! The Empire endures! Thank you, Vessel. Yoo-hoo! How did I not put the rise in the group, man? That did uh, push with their bodies. Even the war wagons are good for a siege. Carl Franz, 238 kills. Zerolti uh, with the buffs. The four year priests are just amazing. Even Mr. Absolute did uh, okay with Soul Blights and the Spirit Leeches. We need healing more than we need that magic. Carbur great swords. One of them had get 370 kills, and the other one had 147 kills. And they were fighting grave guard as well. Six seven guns. Crossbow didn't do much here. We haven't even used all the ammo here. We could have just uh, kept shooting before we started melee. But uh, as you can see, it wasn't needed. Could have uh, lowered the casualties maybe by like 10 15 percent. They send their flyers when we were doing uh, starting melling and we were taking away more damage. But still, we had the uh, X units in reserve.
Close victory. This is a decisive victory game. What the shit? I haven't even used all the crossbow ammo. What determines the rebellions? Uh, the recruitment buildings in the in the settlement. Usually, if there are recruitment buildings, the re uh, rebels are stronger. If there is a military building. What are the trees faction to siege without putting that much thought into it? I would say undead, as in the vampire counts. Uh, but only and the lizardman. Into battle! I command here. We could get attacked here by a lot. We failed the block here. No. Insolence. We have no lightning yes. strike yet. One point off. Lightning strike would make it uh, uh, smooth. Now we have to wonder if they have enough in the range to surround us. Prince and Emperor. That's a very good landmark. 300 income and 40 wine on tier 2. I think we're gonna get besieged here no matter what. From Sigma. Yeah, the so uh, the guild don't got destroyed by the vampires. Oh man, if I done this, it sounds bad. There's something wrong getting a defensive lines there. So they didn't have extra at least. That they usually happens. The blocks are replenishment and they do have a decentish uh, forces in those two. I'll give uh, defensive lines to Belagar. What? By Sigma's will, we cannot. Yeah. In these dark times, we should stand together. Fulfilling vows! Gives automatic military acts as well. Yes? Greeting, stranger. A fool's action. No, no! A weak order. Oh, this is going to 60, it's gonna take a few turns. They will be judged. Bora! Tools of judgment ready. Hunt them out. Is that where heretics? I think they didn't have anything extra in the area. Never. Five units of black knights, uh, two lancers, three regular. Ooh. There's another one here. They have massive experience. But we do have halberdiers. Black Knights for the uh, AI is pretty good because they get uh, high rank fast. They have the bonuses. Is that 
think I uh, remember this battlefield. Maybe we're not very often here. I think I would remember this part of the battlefield. Call France! We have a, a unit of huntsmen here. Uh, they're basically uh, master ambushers without 360 degree. Good for chasing. I'm still control the shot here though. I wish they were a little bit faster. I want to get too close so those knights could engage fast. Well, uh, kind of bit and uh, meet them probably somewhere here. Could uh, take this hill here. Pretty good for the thunder, uh, hunt, hunt, thunders, can guards. Spot as the target. Handgunners. Just a bit to the left, huh? Halberdiers. We are Sigmar's heads. Great. Still not in the greatest shape. Uh, but more bodies. Ready for war. Pass the foe. Reichsguard knights. this We are Sigmar's heirs. Should get a life wizard uh, uh now on tier 4 in Aldorf in white I mean Yes general Sigma calls Sir Ranged weapons ready! And space! Shoot! For the Emperor! No lingering! Powder dry! At your service! Ready! For the Comet! Ready! They're trying to engage in phase, but those knights are gonna be going in fast as well. Ready, General. I will not stand idle. To arms, men. No lingering. Quick march. Sigma calls, sir. Yes, my lord. For Helden Hammer. How quickly has spamming so many heals? There's no way there is so much power immediately.
Reichsguard Knights! Sigma! Guide our fire! Ready for war! I need them on the Ready. Knights. Go! I will not stand idle! Prepare for combat! Take aim! It's not gonna hold on. Moment. Death is imminent. For at least. Ready for war. Launch. Death for sea. Crossbows ready, General. Get. How does guys nice get through here? What the shit? To battle. Charge. Ready. For sea. The right Take the ground. No lingering. Sigma calls. Sigma calls. We obey. Take aim. Can uh, spare men as well. Those that will just kill that man in the next short time. Well, shit. Formation, march! Ready for war! Missile troops! My cameras! For Oldorf! On my command! So we'll have to do with a lot of characters here. The three knights running around and uh, don't give a shit. Reynolds, hey! We're ready! Send those grades so to start killing the evil of this now. Night somehow. Halberdiers! Yes, General! Take the ground! Get them! Sir! In range! I'm By Ulrich's rock! Creators! I'm not gonna control this battle from the Knights of the Dead. For France! Missiles at the ready! Yes! Kind of sandwich it at least. Take it! See to it! Sure those nice. They're fighting to the last uh, rider. Speed. Quick march! Grave danger. Shoot! Take position! I will obey! At speed! Halberdiers! Ready! Moving now! Powder dry! Moving now! Reichsguard Knights! Moving now! Missiles will fly! Awaiting orders! Sigma calls! For 
the Emperor! Take aim! Yes! Quick march! Reichsguard! My subjects call! Move out! We are Sigma's heirs! Ready to serve! Show us the foe! Yes, my lord! To battle! Moving faster! I am Prince and Emperor. Yes. That will stop. Honor to your ancestors. some healing. If I get advanced lines, I can uh, replenish in their territory. It's not safe to stay here. Summon the Elector Counts! The yes, royalty, the war priest was real big in this battle. Holy shit, we would have... Uh, uh, we had the Helm of Disco, the Mentor Sword, uh, Hammer of Sigma, Shield of Fate, so tanky as well. Goddamn Warrior Priests are amazing. Amazing. They get Fate Bastion for better tankiness as well, and then the whole, AO the whole AoE as well uh, damage. Bendiction is the only crap here. Honestly, they should, uh, they should rework this skill. Insurance. Ready. Bring me to my men. We can uh, fully heal royalty almost now. Then I will fight with you. Hey, kids, Nedge, good morning. When uh, a Warhammer 2 is getting patched, it does, uh, has to make a, a backup of the uh, original files first. Then it patches the files, and then it deletes the backup. Imagine something goes wrong with the patching, then you're gonna have to download everything back. Which will take longer than the patching process. The Empire Ready. Those war wagons uh, did a pretty good job in the battle as well. The big bodies uh, uh, were against uh, uh, un uh, regular infantry. Ready for war! Great swords! By Ulrich's rod! Empire marksman! Conditions acceptable! Karl 
France. Ocean toughness. And chicken farbles. Farbles. Is on the gash. No, is on the gash. There's a spirit lich here. Ulrich's wrath on them. Ready for war. Death is imminent. Two hundred meters on overcast. Hey, Rubio. Infantry action. For Heldenhammer! Sigma calls! Go! Ready! Take your name! Warrior Priest! We have a 35% damage reduction to Kalfranz France if he gets a bit leech. Plenty of rest. We had uh, just uh, a very nasty battle against the vampires after we taken uh, uh, the city here. We could have taken some crazy losses, but uh, by some s a miracle uh, we managed to uh, not lose any units. And we just finished them off, so nobody's uh, attacking us in the area. My orders are to move. I command here. Bring me to my men. Show me the accused. It's hard to say if there's anything close. We might not. Uh, 
We might take a chance to get the Plenishment anyways. Who Approach us, friend, and a make fool's action. So one is down to rank 21. We don't know what the whereabouts of their armies, but I guess they are not close. It's probably uh, on the other side here. This here and here. They have to go around. So it could be safe to go into Feldorf. It would be a disaster to lose this army. Fight for our nation! There's a miracle another uh, uh, Kalfranz didn't get wounded or uh, priest getting killed in that battle. It was a miracle. In the first one, the big one. Mumford got wounded uh, uh, in the middle of the fight, Connie. I was a Strigo Eagle King uh, that uh, did damage to the uh, Serral team. Death comes. How it is? Yes, General. Reynolds, aim! We're ready! No lingering! Shield of faith! Taking position! Is imminent. To battle! At speed! The Empire endures. For Helden Hammer! Sir! Now! Somehow he's more still moving with uh, the Mentor Sword. I guess he was in an uh, attack animation. Out of war variance average. I don't need a uh, uh, proper battle skill. And technologies. The technologies are just terrible. My orders are to I move. am Prince and Emperor. Show me the accused. I command here. There's an army here and there's an army here. Arch Nectar! 
true servant of Sigma. Here to serve. The Empire. Summon the Elector Counts. I am France. They will obey. Who now, calls? If this doesn't go through, uh, it's gonna be a huge setback. But uh, all indicators show that they're not close. We have one turn here. I trust no man. I stand defiant. Get a, a mage a building here. Bring me to my men. We can get armor spearmen here. What's the electric kind of Solent? Lowers upkeep on the crossmen, the spearmen, the army. Does lower the upkeep on the electric count state troops. Hopefully, uh, a Roman or uh, uh, she was a Roman don't disappear again into the uh, those bells. This will bolster the nation. I'll get uh, General of the Empire for the Griffon. One more siege attacker will help. Archlector is my preference, though. Yes. This one is actually pretty damn good. So you can get minus 24 leadership for the enemy on Karl Franz. Get fear. You get the uh, blood roar. And uh, you can get uh, another negative 8. It's minus 24 leadership. You get it banner for even more leaders, negative leadership. It's a huge, terrifying effect. This minus 16 will actually even work on the undead, while well, fear will not work. But minus 24 leadership in contact with uh, various leadership penalties, attack from behind, taking damage, losing. This is gonna like increases the high chance of terror highly. This one is very nice. Slows them down and lowers their vigor. <laughs> Dragon Toot. Dragon Toot is so good here, but I want to get immortality before we equip it. Goddamn, the War Priest can so many buffs, it's amazing. It's a uh, moment of truth here, let's see if they're close. If they're close, uh, this is a setback. It will hurt us badly here. Which Hunter uh, had limited vision here. We need to retake Solon and push the vampires back. We just destroyed, uh, we can say, three of their armies. There's no way they ever have, have a fourth one here. Yeah. Let's go up to the game, boys. Let's go up to the game. The game will now save. Hopefully no events. Events happen after the save. They forgot to patch it to happen before the save. Okay, the game just saved. Let's go see what's going on.
Uh, we'll do six. Skulls for the Skulltron, that's the day. Oh no, new DLC for Gladius, let's see what it is. Chimera for the Aster Militarum. That's the, the transport. Tyrion's got a sighted hair duel. Tau, Tidewall, Gunrig. Orcs got a war biker. Necron's a fleet one. Chaos Space Marines, Chaos Land Raider. Oh shit. And the Space Marines get a Razorback. This is uh, really cool. Well, another big monster for the Tyranids. Uh, what was for the Warhammer? Let's see. It's the Skull for the Skull 24. Uh, this year we released a free update to the Lord of Warhammer 2, giving away the biggest, baddest boy on the green skin Ross, the Black Orc Big Boss. And if that was enough, nothing else. Damn, looking good, son. A little bit too green, but looking good. I guess uh, it's just a free update, you don't have to claim it. Not yet in the game. What? The event just started, what do you mean not yet in the game? Uh, we'll check it out, yeah. What's on Total War blog? One second. Total War blog. Meat's monster and meaning the truth behind the meat. What the hell is this shit? Hi, it's the Total War Troy. Why is this looking so cringe? We'll be doing a campaign of Troy when it gets released. Uh, if you have to pick just one orc shaman, but you should have a hag in the army as well, if you can get her. She gives a punishment. It's a pretty good hero. A little bit of everything. What is this update? Uh, no idea. It's looks like it's uh, the orc war boss takes uh, 20 minutes to update.
Yeah, I see, I see how somebody can see the, the sagas to be, you know, test for something and uh, whatever. Hopefully uh, the uh, the mass and the collision is going to be good in uh, Troy. If Melee is not good in Star Wars War games, uh, who the fuck cares? I'm not going to play it. It's not going to have shit, I'm going to have another play Valley. Just look at the Three Kingdoms. Bellas looks so bad. Are there patch notes? No. There's not, there's not seem to be any patch notes. Uh, there's this... Uh, 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 a new whole game that got released that we might check out eventually. Observation. It's a, a indie adventure sci-fi space horror. It's uh, I feel like it's a little more a little bit more science than anything else, because you control an AI. So uh, we might check this out eventually. It's, it looks like a good thing for one day. You know me, guys. I like these type of games. Uh, Change things up a bit. We uh, in nine days we're probably gonna be playing Resident Evil or two or uh, what the hell is this shit called? Hellblade, yeah, Hellblade. On sixth uh, of June. I had nightmares from the, the Hellblade 2 trailer. That's Pinocchio. Hey, Emerald Dragon. Come up yourself. Is Black Orc boss available now? I mean, it should be. It's uh, there's an event going on here. Skulls for the Skull Throne. We click on it. Uh, we find a relevant Warhammer game. It says new Black Orc big boss. New Black Orc Big Boss. This just started, right? 7 p.m. Why the fuck did release the update then, if it's not in the game? Let's restart this team, just to be sure, safe. He's busy looking for the update dog shaman skills. He's only on Reddit.
Uh, Warhammer 1 is the biggest DLC for Warhammer 2 because you get uh, uh, the biggest campaign. If you own both Warhammer 1 and Warhammer 2, in Warhammer 2 you'll uh, have access to the Mortal Empress campaign. Otherwise you'll just have the, uh, the Crap of the Vortex. I fight for the greater good. I'm the one true git. Ha! Ha! We are not starting a new campaign, we are just checking uh, if the Orc War boss is in the game. Black Crag is yours. Gold's fist. Goblin Great Shaman, Night Goblin uh, Warboss, Orc Warboss. I subbed it. Maybe it's in the outer vortex. Maybe you have to unlock the technology tree. Maybe uh maybe they just forgot. Why would they uh, release a new lore for Greenskin, not not a hero, Black Orc? Shit makes no sense. We must preserve this world. Everything belongs to Grom! The waystones that guard all... Let's see, maybe they put it only in the vortex. Where is the Spanish guy? Here, just for you. <laughs> Are you having him better? She's back! <laughs> Had a bit of time off, but enough rest and recuperation! Now, Grom is ready for some more fighting, looting, and mu- <laughs> First things first! I've got to let those unwrap those kids! Restart real life. Okay, let me back here. Let's see. I trust no man. Is that where heretics lurk? You might be able to get this just fine. Get me the field of wine market. Custom bell? No way. Re Uh, 
Uh, not even a custom bell. Maybe it's in a laboratory. Guys, stop debating. What is the laboratory? Uh, waste of funds, effort, repeated procedures. I trust no man. Moving off. So it does look like there's a military force here, and uh, this one is on the move. We may need another spy uh, to check things around. Who caught? By Sigma's will, come in peace. The so fifth one, uh, no. Sig, it is good to see vampires blessing. What? Welcome, my countrymen. Thirty-three. No. No. These guys have distrust the Empire. Yeah, and what can the Dawi do for No! They're 93 right now. What turn is it? 44. Let's see who likes the most car here. What? Honor to your ancestors. They have no, no money. Yes? It is good Midland. to see fellow sons of the Empire. Indeed! 300. Well, welcome. Friends of the Dowie. Uh, we get defensive lines here, which is uh, which is good. It's a little bit too early for military. We don't want to uh, uh, meet these factions yet. Don't have a, such a large treasury, huh? So they would like military alliance more than defensive lines for money. No. They do have a lot of money. And we need some. All right. Never. Never. Go on then. Okay, nice. Do you speak quickly, for I must not be distracted from my vow. It is necessary. Allah greetings. The Phoenix Court will hear your words. Understood. Grudge bearer. Though I serve the late Kislev. The Zarina empowers me to offer you Kislev. I'll pay for tier four arm. Turn 44. 17,000. Let's get the mage building. And. Mm. Mm -hmm. We can get this one on tier 5. Let's get the conclave of battle wizards. I'm just wondering why is this 10k and tier 4 and cost uh, when it's the same shit as this building on uh, tier 3 and 7.5k. And it's, uh, you know, lost in translation. Huh? I want to get the, the uh, menagerie. We could put the gunsmith into the Heimskar summer house. It's kind of wasting the capital. <laughs> this gives us an additional four rings for the Bellavis, which is great.
Shame uh, we didn't get the continuous production before that. We could have saved uh, quite a bit of gold, but holy fire is important. Summon the Elector Count. We've beaten the vampire forces here. I think we can take Solon, uh, uh, Steingard, Solon's province now. This is 3k. By the comet. We do have a lightning strike. The skill is not bad, but it's 3 points. Logistician is not bad either. But uh, not a priority. Let's go for Sharpshooter. We got Sharpshooter and Taser Battle and Send Your Ground here. It's been going pretty good. We just had a couple of battles with the vampires. One was a close one. Into battle. Fight for our nation. Okay, the emperor has taken. Uh, we're taking his points. You have to cross the river, so good. This is the natural border here. You have to go around to get there fast. Any general tips to prepare for the Chaos Invasion? Uh, sure, sure. Uh, just play this guy. During the trailer and uh, during the turns. By the comet. Other than that, uh, lightning strike uh, is uh, is help. Reinforce the uh, the walls with uh, armor piercing garrisons. That's it. So. I'm gonna wait with this one and uh, get the. Uh, this thing is a lot of money. Honor to your ancestors. Won't happen. How do beastmen uh, still manage to stay alive? I don't understand. The uh, you have a proposal? We are willing. A to weak order. Absolutely not. Oh, this is building up. Ever take the fort soul next? Then we'll uh, reclaim our land. We need authority. We really need authority. Shame that this doesn't hit 10. We could actually lose. We need a, a lucky event there. Well, if. Uh, depending where you're gonna fight them, but. Uh, when you have a wall and a settlement, put an iron piercing uh, army on top of the garrison, and that will. Uh, uh, should be enough to uh, weaken them quite a bit. That and the lightning strike on your armies uh, should make chaos a joke. You only have a one-sided outer resolve in your favor, especially have range units. So you might not even need to face them in the field. It all depends what faction you're playing and uh, which chaos are you fighting. Chaos uh, uh, here is uh, more difficult than the chaos here or here, simply because you know, they pick their spots where to land. And usually the spots are not uh, a garrison unless it's much later in the campaign. With Gorok, well, the Lizard have uh, weak garrisons, so you should uh, have an army reinforcing the, uh, the settlements, at least uh, the coast. They should have no chance uh, against your army. And then you just beat them up. 
If you have funds, then you have another army and uh, you just protect the whichever way they go. It's easier, this part is easier to protect than this part here. Regarding the units, uh, any dinosaurs really with uh, with the Saurus uh, spears or temple guards uh, gonna give it much advantage in the garrison. With the uh, Slan, Lord of Life leading your army, you're basically just better chaos. I can return a city to Elector County if he's been destroyed. Getting gorst on Calfran is amazing, getting yeah, poison. For that is all. Poison on Calfrans is amazing. Also on Walkman too. Got Wall of Fire, very strong technology. Cross the reload times on a lot of units. Yes. So now a uh, rank 7 crossman have 8.1 reload time. That's uh, down from... Uh, uh, 11.7 and they can get even better. Ask another. This is nice. I think he's trying to go for Fort Soul. Now, help them out. March on the witches. The issue is if we defeat him on the river, we're gonna uh, move on the other side of the river. I think. Who calls? Never. Demigrave building. Since we have no artillery, this campaign of Demigrives are a uh, way to go. Demigrives with infantry and uh, various range units. Bring me to my men. Ulrich's will. What? I command here. Poison attack for Carl Franz, which is very strong, makes him much better tanking. I am Prince and Emperor. Attack! Now. Got additional defense here. This is a uh, uh, best in slot for the warrior priest. Helm of Discord, Tormentor Sword, One Horseman Speculum, Debuff AoE, Debuff AoE, Debuff AoE. You wanna have a ward save here. Then you have uh, AoE melee buff, AoE ward save, AoE bombardment. God damn, the warrior priests are so good. So good. Summon the Elector Counts. Oh my god. Have you seen that shit? They Holy will shit. be judged. What the hell? We're gonna take Fort Soul first before invading here. Bring me to my men. I see no other option. Step to it! Thanks, all sins. Sharpshooter, missile resistance, little time reduction, missile strength. 
for uh, missile units. Uh, taste for battle, physical resistance, melee attack, melee defense for the important melee units, great swords, halberdiers, and the dam griffs. I command here. This one was renamed. Uh, let me remember what it was. Uh, Skulltron. I want a confederate Hochland. I want a sort of Imperial Authority as well, so we have to get to Authority first. We actually are behind our Authority right now because three uh, accounts got, uh, three little accounts got destroyed uh, by the vampires. We destroyed one ourselves, so you lose ma two every time. Confederation is three. Get a life wizard as well. Uh, we should be getting an empire captain soonish as well. Uh, this should be still final tier one. Well, uh, whatever you feel like, but the best hints are Black Chorus, Arknock, Spiders, and Doom Divers. There are some units that are close to that, but uh, that combination uh, I feel like it's the best. We should get in purchase of the fell, we still haven't got it done. Uh, I'm just gonna wait one turn, and oh this technology God. gives us plus 10 attack and plus 10 leadership when fighting oh against shit. the vampire counts. What also the makes hell? auto resolve uh, uh, very one sided in a lot of situations. You see the auto resolve there, and they were still trying to engage us uh, at this on top. This on top of uh, veteran units, uh, it's super one-sided. One of the reasons why the AI Empire sometimes just steamrolls. When you do uh, the first battle uh, uh, with the Empire, the quest battle, uh, you get a random wizard, and it was an Amethyst wizard. And better have a battle wizard in the army than no wizard. The scouting alone is worth it, let alone the use for power. The Soul Blight is good uh, for the Swordsman, and you can always cast Spirit Leech, but uh, it falls behind after you get the Swordsman. Kinda wanna get Life Wizard as soon as possible. Emperor has uh, set up for two Wizards in the army. So, uh... We got Amethyst Wizard, so we might as well use him. So we just stuck with him. We have enough uh, wizard slots uh, with uh, the buildings, so I'll be getting other wizards too. Ring of the Isle is a pretty cool unit. It's very tanky. I think uh, one of in the army is is fine. The only looking, uh, it has to be a, a campaign where uh, you actually consider playing uh, just. Longer for sure, because you know it's not very convenient to recruit with tier five. Ooh, lucky! We need more torch like that. Uh, Booker will sp spy the border here. Is that where heretics lurk? Step to it. The nation calls. We're going for the fourth soul next. As is my right by Sigmar's crown. On march. Sigmar compels us onward. We secured the border here, and then we go deeper into the uh, vampire territories. Kalfranz is really solid now. Uh, we have a potion of healing, silver seal, grudge settler, and armor destiny. Minus 24 leadership on impact. Uh, with other, it's probably over more minus 40 leadership when he just lands from from air. On the undead, it's probably over 30 negative leadership. We have a pretty tanky reward save, five physical resistance. We just need regrowth. 
We have 15 missile resistance and 15 uh, magic resistance. Uh, we have not anything in the, his fighter skills. Uh, we'll be getting some. We're almost done with battle skills. Uh, we actually, yeah, almost done so we can get his fighter skills. And we have some skills available. He's very flexible to build up. Very flexible. You definitely have uh, several flavor skill points. I will not betray you. So we need uh, a little bit more here to get to poor absolute. So, approach us 58. and make your offer. All right. Except on 58. Who call? Approach us friend and make your this offer. This is usually on 35. But there are other various factors like distrust the Empire. If they, if they have distrust, it requires double than usual. We cannot. Uh, the Empire has super yes. queen diplomacy uh, I will not due obey. to uh, the technologies. Let's call them the order type technologies. This is basically uh, the people you want to deal with. Trade and ally eventually. And these are your friends. I would still like to consider getting this one because uh, it's going to save so much money in the long term. We can uh, also consider getting uh, the file rifle barrels for more damage and this one here. Uh, this is uh, probably the best tier of technologies on the top. Now this one is the second best. I wish all these technologies were uh, working on the steam tanks, luminarchs and uh, war wagons, what but they the don't. Hell? I pay for Netflix and Disney, but all I watch is your channel, lol. Finished your Legend of Grimrock playthrough the other day, what an amazing game. Please accept my lurker money. All hail Emperor Alec. King and Rikin, appreciate it. Yeah, Legend of Grimrock is uh, such a nice game. We might even uh, replay it in the in the future again. But I want to try over Porum first, uh, when we have some downtime. This technology is also so good. God damn this uh, uh this technology this store so good. I love it. Let's try to get this one uh uh so we can uh buff our finances. This is also the research rate. You can also try to get more students now and save more heroes. This this campaign still has plenty to go. We are playing onto the short campaign victory. I have to fight off uh, Arcane as well. We're just pretty much just having a quarter of the Empire here. Uh, our biggest four right now are the Vampires. And uh, we are sorting out diplomacy with the other people. If the Dwarves win, uh, it'll be probably definitely a smoother campaign. If the Dwarves lose, it'll be a longer campaign. We might need to consider sending an army to help the Dwarves. Especially because of the Skaven. The Skaven are probably the bigger threat than the Greenskins. Income is looking really good. Our trade resources are only wine and uh, pottery. Unfortunately, we lost uh, iron. The beast raised that settlement was taken by Hochland. If we get iron and marble here, we'll be swimming in money. It is good to see Marienburg is pretty much fighting off Norska for us. Day. They're taking down Koron and they have uh, quite a bit of power here. Fine! So, uh, we have to deal with this. What? The Empire, alright? Uh, we're gonna get more authority here. So these guys might uh, uh, see yes. now. What? The Empire. So, uh, so there's definitely room for more authority. We want to have positive authority. 
we are at the point where we can consider a second army, but I want a second army to be a uh, tier 3 and above, not just a backup army. A backup army does uh, save us from wrecking mauling. Now, Steingard is the war zone right now. We need to sort of Fort Soul first. It looks like a tier 3 garrison, uh, hopefully not tier 4. We do have two Carbor great, uh, great Swords, uh, which are pretty good in the sieges. And we're just working on getting healing. This will bolster the nation. What, uh... What, uh, 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 what, who, who, what, who is this? CA, come on, can you not do anything right? What is this? This is a bug with the event, huh? To strengthen the Empire. The game getting ahead of itself. This is plus one with Hochland, so this is, at least it's pretty good. This looks like fine for auto resolve. And we get 10 with Hochland. There are definitely uh, bugs uh, going on with the Lords uh, uh, when this happens. The game should uh, decide you w which Lord to send. But uh, uh, sometimes it just gets bugged. Sigma. Now we got a force here. This is so weird. Yes, my lord. This should be uh, like this uh, in the first place. This how you do it, CA. That's how we do it. That force should become my force, and I should be able to do what uh, with it what I want. Not just disappear. It almost like look they they tried to fix it, but uh, we get ten field with Hochland now. Unfortunately, we're gonna have to delay Confederation by uh, twenty turns, cause uh, I don't want to be a negative radar authority. Okay, that's plus one fealty with Hochland. Not possible. Approach us, friend, and make your offer. Not likely. We can now confederate them uh, pretty much uh, within a few turns, but we need authority. The, uh, you have a proposal? We are willing to hear I it. I don't agree. No. Yes. Somehow they managed to get Pick an army base. here around, huh? Forward! I refuse. Now we need to take Fort Sol first. Is it time? To war. You see in the game now? Men, we must attack. Finally getting some proper balance of power. This technology is such a time saver. That it could have been a 50 minute siege. Ready. Hey, there, bro. Tier two. I'm gonna some growth here. Who calls? Okay, it looks like the south is secure. Uh, there's a war zone going on here, uh, so this is where we fight next. Remove gunsmith from the white run and put it in Heimsker summer house. This is to unlock Volkmar. Looking at our Emperor Captain. Uh, cunning Monster Hunter and Weapon Master. Cunning and Weapon Master are pretty good for battles. 
But uh, I'm not gonna put in the bells because they're so plain and basic. It's additional campaign spy, pretty much. from Sigma. One thing is... Sorry guys, getting the cold. This game doesn't work. This is it. Um, this will be amazing. This is amazing, but uh, it will go minus four, so we have to delay it. And we are back to zero. Since uh, um, um, Vampires destroyed two electric counts, destabilized things a bit for us. Which is actually pretty good. This, uh, this thing makes now way more sense. Since the Vampires are threat again. At least in the early game. Uh, we can show it right now, or we can save the game here. Oh, Keep in mind, guys, these events happened after the game got saved. They forgot to... Uh, uh, for forgot to, to make this event before the autosave. It should be that event, you pick, and then autosave. They forgot about Legend difficulty again. The, this was an issue on some things in the, in the past, and they got fixed, but since uh, you know this got uh, patched later, they forgot again. Whoever did this did not keep in mind uh, legendary difficulty. Autosave happens after the uh, uh, after the, uh, before the event, so that event does not happen if you are about to end it right now for the day or go to something else. You know. Can I revive guild in uh, Stangert? Yes, yes, I can. I fight for the greater good. Dear bro, you here? Penalty the big boss is here. Let's go check. Well, they do assertion because they patch this. There were some events, important events that uh, were happening uh, uh, after the game saved. And they fixed this. They made the events happen before the autosave. But uh, now they introduce again a type of events that happens after autosave. Uh, and it didn't work. Because they they uh, they fixed this in the past. We may need to restart again now. Uh, Phil Impulse asks, "Why uh, this number one? We played Reichland before a few times. No, this is the first time we played Reichland. Uh, we played Empire eight times in Warhammer Two. It was called the Empire back. This is a uh, first time as Reichland." Since the factions got renamed.
Elithios, uh, the Skulls uh, Skulltron events started and they released the, bl uh, the Black Orc uh, character. I fight for the greater good. I'm the one true. It's the end morning. I don't think they patched anything, they just uh, released uh, something on top. You might not see a patch in the next month. Hey John Flip, thank you for King Sport. Black Crag is yours, my. Well, I do not have it in my game. Oh, there it is, uh, Black Orc Big Boss. It's a hero. Hallelujah. And you unlock him on a tier 3. Assault Garrison, Assault Units. Yoo-hoo! As immune psychology, fear, misresist, and courage. Uh, Rebel Rouse himself and the units arrange immune psychology. Jesus fucking Christ. He has rally as well. What about his skill tree, guys? Is there any unique skills? Nothing unique? Oh my fucking god, what is the point of the even releasing this? I guess a uh, nice campaign hero. Assault units and assault garrison. Is it as white as the orc shaman? Hold on, hold on. Starts with I am Tyrion, heir of Anarium. I got me, brother. You tell me he has nothing for the army. Nothing. Why is it not like this? See you later. Plotting and scheming. No, that can't be right. That can't be right, guys. All this time we're waiting for the Black Orc uh, 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 hero and nothing on him? Is this what you're telling me, guys? This whole time, nothing for the orc boys, vegans, or the black orcs. Doesn't even have replenishment. Oh my god, doesn't even have a voice actor. Not even a voice actor. 
Straight out of Molten Core Raid. Not even a voiceover. No, that can't be right. No, I don't believe that. This is the time, boys. Spend your points. Wow! This is the first time they release a hero without a voice. And it's not a, you know, some silent guy like Kane the Assassin or the or the uh, Phoenix Guard. Are you fucking kidding me? Not even armor piercing. It's a uh, a lot of armor and uh, uh, good shield. Oh my god! Oh my god! What is this shit? Nothing? I haven't gotten drunk in a while guys, I think I'm gonna get drunk. And uh, we're not gonna play in green skin time soon. I'm getting drunk. Guys, I'll, I'll see you in a bit. Oh my god. Have you seen that shit? Holy shit. 